Hi, this is Carrie from Homestead Howe, and in today's episode, we're going to talk about our Voda heat powered wood stove fan. stove supplements our normal heat from our outdoor wood burner. You may have seen in that video. The last video I am referring to is our outdoor wood burner, Is It Worth It Four Years Later? The video blew up. Uh, there's a link for it in the description below. It also heats our loft up here, which is Katie's room, another video we did in the past. You may be wondering, why the heck do these people have a slide in their house? It's a very good question. We got that slide at the Habitat Restore for $10, and when I saw it at the Habitat Restore, I just thought, man, that thing would fit perfectly in Katie's loft. So we bought it, and it does fit pretty good there, and Katie has a good time with it. But in today's video, we're not talking about our slide, we're gonna be talking about our indoor wood stove, and in particular, this little Voda heat-powered wood stove fan. This thing is really cool. It's a little gadget. You can actually purchase these on Amazon. It's an Amazon Choice product. They come in three different colors. And the cool thing about it is there's no batteries, there's no power supply. The entire thing is powered by a little electric motor. So as the wood fire gets hotter, the fan starts turning. And the hotter it gets, the faster the fan turns. And it's a really clever design and we've been using it for several months now and it works really well to circulate the heat around. So we have it right here. We have cathedral ceilings in here as you can see with the slide. And unfortunately with that, a lot of the heat rises and it's up on the top of the ceiling. Well with this, we can blow the heat and keep it down at our level um, more than we would without having the fan. The other thing that's really cool with this is we can turn it this way, and if we go that way, which I'll show you in a second. That's my new office that we built. And that office is connected to our outdoor wood burner, so it does have some heat, but leading up to the months before we turn that wood stove on outside, we supplement the heat with this. Rather than turn that big thing on outside that uses 10 cords of wood a year, we wait till as long as possible, and instead of turning the propane on, we use this in the meantime. And when it's just not completely below zero out, this keeps the house pretty warm, and it also keeps my office nice and warm with this fan. I've noticed a huge difference using this fan versus just having nothing and just having the heat radiate off of it. Not much heat gets into that room where this is directing the flow of heat right into that office. All right, so we're gonna start a fire and we're gonna show you how this thing works, but first let's talk about some of the pros and the cons. Let's start with the cons, and to be honest, there aren't many. Um, I think one con would be there's no guard over this fan, so if you do have little ones around your homestead or your house, you could get a finger in there and it could hurt. Um, that's one of the cons. The price, this thing was uh, just under $50, so it's not uh, inexpensive, but considering it doesn't use any electricity, that seems like a pretty good price. There are other fans you can get for wood stoves. You can get electric fans that go on the back that are like blowers, but of course those are gonna use electricity. Those would push a lot more air than something like this. This is gonna push a limited amount of air compared to a blower that you would have on the back of the unit that's powered by uh, your standard 115 volts in your house. So those are, those are some of the cons. Some of the pros are, it just looks kind of cool. It, it runs by itself. You don't have a switch that you have to turn on to use it. It's just always there and as soon as the fire gets hot enough, it starts turning and circulating the air for you. When the fire goes off, the fan goes off. So that's kind of a, a cool little side effect of it. Um, the other pro that I really like about this is we can set it anywhere we want. So during the day when we're in this main living area, we have it aimed this way to concentrate some of the air in the main living area. During the weekday when I'm working in my office, which is right through that door there, I turn it this way 
and we're able to direct quite a bit of heat that way, a noticeable amount of heat. And that was the main reason I purchased it. So I really like that feature. And then at night, if we got a really good fire going, but everyone goes off to bed, but the fire's still going, I'll aim it this way, which will direct some of the heat to the back hallway, and that's where the bedrooms are. So that's kind of a cool feature of it. Unlike a blower that's mounted on the back that only blows one way, this you can direct it in any direction that you want. The reason I purchased this one is because it was an Amazon choice item. Those are sort of items that are recommended by Amazon. They're usually pretty good. And it had some really, really good reviews. So again, we'll leave a link in the description, but it does come in multiple colors and uh, available right on Amazon. We ordered it and 24 hours later, it was at our homestead, which was pretty cool. All right, so let's make a fire and, and show this thing in action. All right, it's been just over 10 minutes and the fan has started to kick on. It's going slow right now, but the fire is not up to full heat. It's not even close yet. So once I get some hot coals in there, I'll add another wood and it'll, it'll start cranking. So in conclusion, I listed some pros and cons of our Voda wood fan. And uh, in conclusion, is it worth it? We paid about $50 for this and in our opinion, yes, it is indeed worth it. Like I mentioned before, we've used this wood stove for several years now. So we've got sort of a good baseline understanding of how much heat it puts out. And with our situation with the cathedral ceilings, the fact that we have a an adjacent room right here that has very little heat and gets really cold and that we can change the direction and sort of the, the flow of the heat. Uh, we definitely think it's worth the $50 price tag, especially because it doesn't use any electricity and it constantly runs by itself. So we definitely suggest it if you don't have one and you do have a wood stove and you want to maximize the heat you get from it. Check out one of these. We have a link in the description below.